Hello Libra, I am Ulrich, I am a Lenormand card trader and today we will do the money business work card trading for the sign of Libra for the month of January. Um, I will do or make this card trading as uh, short as possible, but of course I want to deliver you a quality product so it will require some of your time. As always, we will do four card readings for the sign of Libra for the month of January, and these are based on the natural elements in your astrological chart or for some of you on your time of birth. These basic elements are air, earth, water, and fire. Now, the four objects that you always see on my table are directly connected to those elements. So you choose or you pick one that you think relates most to your personality or you choose one you feel most comfortable with. This object of your choice, it should or it will relate the best to your current situation. However, if the object and the related video does not match your first choice, please check the other videos that are immediately connected in the same session. I'm sure one of the four will fit you. Anyway, the matches represent the fire element, the stone represents the earth element, the aerosol sprayer represents the air element, and the shell represents the water element. Uh, I also want to add, uh, if you have questions, you can always post them on the comments below. And of course, as soon as I have time, uh, I, will, I will answer them. Anyway, uh, here we go, Libra, uh, for your uh, card reading for January. Hello Libra and welcome to the Shell or the Water Group for your business money uh, work card reading for the month of January. As the first card here on your portrait, we see the tower. The tower is, uh, it tells us that uh, probably we take care of our health, we want to look good, we want to feel good, we move also. Uh, we like to feel good in our body, especially with the sun here. Maybe we uh, like also to have uh, some kind of sun tan around us uh, here. This is what we are seeing here. Anyway, it points that we take care of our body. Uh, we move with the storks here, we move also a little bit here and with the birds here. Uh, anyway, uh, it points also that we take care of our body, we eat healthy also, this is what we are uh, seeing here. Um, sometimes also with the tower, uh, it tells us that uh, we, uh, if we are not patient, we probably need to be a bit patient here uh, with this combination. Sometimes also it points to uh, no shortcuts. There is discipline also sometimes here, structure here. The tower requires structure in our life, consistency. Um, we need to uh, push things through here with the tower here, we need to be uh, very consistent here. This is what we are seeing. On the central card here, we see the stork. The stork is the bird about changes, big changes here uh, that we are seeing here. Uh, activity, movement, getting things on the move here, getting things moving. Things are about to happen. We take initiative. This is all what we see here uh, with the stork here. Probably we, will, we are about to take the lid off. Uh, we want to have uh, shine more in our life. This is what we are seeing here. We want to be more in the center of attention. This is what we are seeing here. Then we are gonna go to the tower, the birds and the clovers here. Uh, here, uh, probably we had some communication with some authorities or people in charge uh, before, um, and we get uh, a response now on this communication here, or it's relevant now. Um, and here we see that we consider the words that we have been told before here. There were some discussions before probably about leadership, about responsibility in the business, or there are some communication in our business about certain responsibilities. If we have a business, probably we communicate with staff and this uh, conversations come back now or we if we ourselves uh, we had communication with higher authorities and this is relevant now what is happening here anyway there's uh, some discussions here communication here with leadership with people in charge uh, and it caused maybe uh, some tensions here maybe before everything is said or not everything is said this is what we are uh, seeing here anyway it points also to official announcements that we are seeing here uh, it's best here with the tower to stay calm to not reveal everything to keep our basic ground, keep our feet on the ground here. This is what we are seeing here. Best not to get overwhelmed with emotions here with this uh, combination. We just keep uh, uh, how we are. Uh, maybe we can uh, also, uh, we keep some distance here. This is what we are seeing here. We not get too emotionally involved if we are confronted with certain authorities. This is what we are seeing here. It's best here to distance ourselves if these people uh, would cause us stress here. This is what we are seeing here. Sometimes also this points to uh, stress. If, for instance, if we work for 
uh, the government or for public offices that some people are causing a stress or we come in uh, chaotic, stressful situations. This is what we are seeing here. Sometimes also it points that the rules are not clear for everybody, that the rules are a little bit chaotic and they're all over the place. Then we have the clovers and the birds here. Uh, this points here the, mostly to um, uh, good fortune here, good things are happening here. We get positive uh, feedback here. Some people are helping here. There's a lot of uh, communication here. Um, there's probably here we have also, um, we had some conversations and maybe um, something went wrong during a conversation. And um, maybe we uh, overlooked, we misjudged um, the situation, maybe we didn't see as it truly was, maybe we didn't look deep enough. This is what we are seeing here uh, with this combination. But here we see that uh, with the birds here and the sun, the sun is an all over positive cards. We are uh, able to mend it. We are able to, to fix it. This is what we are seeing here. There could also be some gossip here and we uh, straighten out uh, some gossip here. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Uh, also, it points this combination that we, uh, if there are some chances appearing, we should act uh, quickly here. Uh, some authorities, maybe they don't last very long. If you have certain authorities, you need to take them or you need to jump at them here because it's important you take them here uh, with this combination. Then we have the tower uh, and the mice. We're gonna mirror the cards here. The tower and the mice here, um, here, there we could have some regrets here. Uh, we could uh, dwell over the past, maybe about conversations, maybe of something that happened in our workplace, uh, maybe certain business uh, things that uh, not went as we as as we thought that would be. It's like we dwell a little bit on the past here with this combination. Anyway, we cannot stay too long in this situation. We need to move away, move on from it here. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. Also, if we see that um, certain people are corrupted or they are not good hearted to us um, here, we, we better let it go here. This is what we are seeing here. Um, we cannot have let those people too much influence here, especially if these influences are corrupted, unjust. This is what we are seeing here. Uh, it, we could be confronted with those uh, corporate uh, corporate injustices here, what we are seeing here, uh, corporate management that is not correct, that it's dwindling. Uh, maybe the business where um, if you work in a business, it's possible that some things are not very clear there. If you have a business, it's possible also that you have some, um, how do we say that, that there are some delays. The mice sometimes cause delays and you need to uh, look into it in the details, what is ex ex uh, exactly causing these delays. You could uh, experience some of these delays in business because some ground rules are not correct. This is what we are seeing here with this combination. It's possible that the structure, the foundations is not totally correct here. This is what we are uh, seeing here. And you need to adjust it here because else you could have some uh, damage on the long run. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Then we have uh, the house and the, the house and the stork here. Um, here we see that uh, it's possible that there are some changes. Maybe you change branch, maybe you change location uh, for your work or you move your business in another place. Uh, and this could be a positive step here, especially with the sun that we are uh, um, doing here. Uh, it's possible also that we rename our uh, business or rename our project. This is what we are seeing here. Uh, anyway, there's a lot of uh, balance here. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. Probably we try to do this in an elegant, sophistic way. This is what we are seeing here. There's a lot of changes here uh, in the house and this literally can point to a move. Uh, it will be a very structural move organized here. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Uh, sometimes also this could mean that you relocate your business to another um, city. But since we have the store here, it's possible also that you re relocate your business in another country because the stork is a migrating bird and it's possible that we consider to um, changing our business or to change business or to work in abroad. It's possible that we move our business in abroad or we as an employee, we move ourselves in abroad. This is what we are seeing here. Or it's possible that you make an extension 
in abroad. This is what we are seeing here also. This is all possible with this uh, combination. Anyway, certain traditions here will be changing here. Um, there will be certain conflicts as we saw earlier. And it actually, we want to be more secure with this. We want to build more security for ourselves. Then we have the stork and the sun here. The, the changes are very positive here that we are uh, seeing here with this combination. Um, things will uh, unfold here in a very uh, positive way. The changes that we are seeing are welcome. There's a lot of communication about uh, these changes here that we are seeing here. And we ourselves, or we are transforming the way we communicate. It's like the communication that we do, it goes more in depth. There is more behind it. It's like more psychological, deeper here that we are seeing here. We also have the will to act here. And we see the migration here again, relocating here that is possible to another country or another city. This is what we are seeing here. And possibly this is, uh, if you go, this will be a migration to a sunny, warm place. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Anyway, there is a positive outlook here on life here. We want to shine in abroad. We want to be more important. Our business wants to be more important here. Um, also, people around you, they will tell you if they re-meet you that there are some changes in you, that they they will recognize you, of course, you physically, but if they communicate with you, they will see uh, or they will tell you there are some things changed in you, like psychological changes here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with these combinations. You will see that some truths that you hold before as very high that your uh, your ideas are changing about that. Also change of opinions here, uh, we see here. Anyway, um, we changing slowly here from a more unstable situation uh, in a more uh, confident uh, position. We have more strength and we here, we want to, um, find our full potential here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination. We want to take a better uh, care of ourselves here. And we are very uh, optimistic about these uh, changes. Then we have the house and the sun. We mirror the cards here. Uh, here there, there's like, um, maybe there's also, um, if we do some changes, there's a period after that we decide that we stay more in the home. Or it's possible that we work more on the home front or we change our house so we can work in the home place. This is what we are seeing here. Um, but here we see that we want to invoke our whole potential. This is what we are seeing here. And it's possible also that the place where we are gonna go that our house is literally in a sunny spot here. This is what we are seeing here. It's possible also that uh, if you have the financial abilities that you uh, keep your house in uh, your domestic country and there comes a second branch in, uh, in another place, in another country, in abroad. This is what we are uh, seeing here uh, with this combination. Sometimes also point, this points that our fam family life, uh, the people also with us, they are happy with the changes that we are about to undertake. Then we have the stork, um, uh, the, sorry, the tower, the stork and the book here. And here, uh, some things out of the past, we see this here again, uh, they have sig significant, they become significant now here. Um, it's possible also that we, uh, that we elevate ourselves to a higher level. And it's all happening in a very positive things here, positive uh, things, uh, communication from before, uh, events from the past here now seem to work out in a positive way um, and they, could be literally written down. This sometimes also points to a business in abroad that some things are off officialized in abroad. This is what we are seeing here because we have the book here, accountancy in abroad. This is what we are seeing here, money in abroad. Uh, this is uh, what we are seeing here. Here also, we see that some things that you didn't see before because we have the sun and the book here. Uh, some things that you were not clear for you will be revealed here. Uh, some Maybe something was not clear for you or a secret. Something is uh, revealed here. If things were uh, moving slowly before, here we see that now we are able to move forward. This is what we are seeing here. It's possible also um, if you uh, do some business that you uh, gain some additional education in abroad or related to the business for being more a cur of the situation because we see the book here and the book is study. This is a study in depth here that we are seeing here because uh, here we see a person that wants more education. If you would be a student, this points also to students 
or people who educate additional here for getting more knowledge here. And this, north, this knowledge bring you uh, in, a transfer, in a transformation. This is the, the transformative power here of education here. And we discover another truth here. We also this points that we keep on learning. We keep educating ourselves here with this uh, combination on the long run here. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. Uh, this also points to a person who has a, a quite a fairly good intellect here. This is what we are seeing here, the, an, an intellectual a person by nature. This is what we are are seeing here. It could be that certain uh, things are not easy to move. Maybe something related um, to accountancy or something. It's like there's a temporary stop here regarding that. Uh, this is what we are seeing here, but this is on, only temporary uh, what we are seeing here. It could also be that um, Maybe temporary, you feel a little bit uh, held like under the weather here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with um, maybe you do some checkup, maybe you don't feel so good, but these are temporary uh, problems here because we have the sun here. Uh, so uh, this will be temporary. Um, but maybe we this uh, it could also point to the medical uh, annual checkup here that we are seeing here or do you do a checkup before you travel uh, this is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination um, anyway also uh, we accept certain truths here in our life here uh, also we learn out of the past we use what we have learned out of the past if things come to a standstill here um, it's possibly here that this is a temporary standstill and you need this, this standstill because there are inside yourself also there is a transformation going on and you need to be uh, see that you are ready um, mentally also for these changes so maybe we you withdraw a little bit bit in the house there for undergoing these changes then we have the sun and the book here this points to success here um, if you do an additional study you will uh, you will just do this study in depth and you will be very successful here about this additional education that you are doing here the, the these uh, this is a very good uh, achievement that you have here um, and also sometimes here it points that we share this knowledge with other people this is what we are seeing here but there is a kind of success if you're if this for instance is for a student this points to a student who has success here this is what we are seeing the knowledge that we are gaining it brings us also success in our business this is what we are seeing here in general this is a, a very a very good card reading except here there could be some uh, delays here that we are experiencing maybe related to um uh, to accountancy, but here, uh, if we want to solve it and if we want to work it out, and what is the problem is sometimes with the mice, the, the issues are in the details. Maybe there are some details here regarding work, regarding money, regarding accountancy that you need to check out, or maybe you need to adjust some things. With the mice, sometimes it's in the details and there are temporary delays because of that. Anyway, uh, this is all for Libra. I hope you get a little bit wiser out of this uh, financial business money card reading. If you did, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, if this card reading don't fit your role, please check the other three that are connected here. I'm sure one of the four will fit you. Uh, anyway, I want to thank you for your time and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you and bye bye for now. Hello, Libra, and welcome to the Aerosol or the Air Group for your uh, work business money card reading for January. As the first card here, we see the clouds. But the clouds is the card that tells us, uh, this is the card on our person. Uh, this tells us that we need to focus in certain areas on our life. If there are some areas that we are confused about, we need to focus more. Uh, maybe also there's a strong focus on friends and relationships to friends, or we should focus more in those areas. Also, this is a very, uh, if we should uh, create uh, very uh, strongly also on the creativity side of ourselves and our work and our business here. This is what we are seeing here. There's need for focus here. And we see need to see also that we need to get emotionally uh, involved here. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Uh, sometimes also it means that um, we need to do this because the, the moon is a quiet, a soft card. We need to do this in a soft, 
quiet, uh, restful way here. Uh, these changes here, these adjustments here, this focus, we cannot rush things here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this combination. Then on the central card, we have the house, which is our home, the place where we live, but of course also the business, the place where we work here. Uh, this is, uh, it means if it's on the central card, uh, it means that it's very important for us, our business. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Also, we need to see if um, that we have, if we are about to build more, that our foundations are very strong because here we see building on the long run. And if we don't have the solid foundations, later on our business could be shaky. So we need to see here with this combination that we focus on very strong, solid foundation because this is something that we are about to do on the long run, the creativity that we are about to expand on the long run here. We will attract also a lot of uh, customers here because we have the moon and the dog here and this is attractive customers here so see that you have solid foundations that you deliver a quality product here to your customer and this could be very good on the long run here if we uh, do so here with this combination anyway uh, also we uh, it doesn't mean because we need to think we need to breathe we need to be calm we need to procast we need to slowly move ahead here and see we have the right foundation there is not not that we need to procast but we need to move slowly in an intelligent wise way here this is what we are seeing here the house is not a very fast card and the lily also is a slow card it, it's like the moving need to be slowly deliberate balanced here this is what we are seeing here libra is balanced so you need to do it in a in a balanced way here the moving on here this is what we are uh, seeing here there could be certain challenges that you are facing here but if you think wisely about them you will uh, be able to overcome uh, certain challenges uh, and you will come in a more secure solid position because the house requires solidness it's possible also that uh, you need to be quite strict towards yourself for opening times for customers you need to stick to the rules of the game here the house is quite strict so you will need to keep uh, to the rules of the game on the long run here. If you are not, you will be confronted with certain things here because the cross brings us back here. It confronts us with responsibilities. So if you build something solid, this comes to you in a very positive way. If you keep to certain structures here, this is what we are seeing because these are very solid cards on the long run. Uh, if you deliver a quality product, the customers um, will keep coming back. This is what we are seeing here, especially with the moon. The moon comes back, it's a cycle. So you see a cycle here that the customers are coming back if you build solid foundations. This is what we are seeing here. Then we have the clouds. Um, the lily and the anchor. Uh, here with the clouds and the lily here, we see that uh, probably we also some stress in the business here. This is what we are seeing here. We need to see that we have su sufficient people who help, her, help us. If you have not sufficient employees or people who help here, you need to adjust your staff here because else maybe it's too stressing for you, the situation here. This is what we are seeing it. We cannot uh, overdo it here because else maybe we have no overview anymore. This is what we are seeing here and we losing track we lose our focus if it becomes too much this is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination we need to see that uh, we can keep our focus on our initial attention and uh, this is uh, very important here that there are no misunderstandings misdirections here uh, this is what we are seeing here then we have the lily and the anchor uh, here we see that um that we are um holding on to the business that we are having uh, we want to make it more secure the anchor once it's 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 dropped uh, we want to make things more secure the house is a little bit the same once the house is there we cannot move the house the anchor is the same so these are solid cards so here you are required to focus on st stability long uh, term projects this is what we are seeing here you need to see that you are very solid here this is required from you here from the cards here uh, also uh, probably if you have staff you need to support your staff and of course they support you also uh, if you do so it will um, unfold for very positive here 
and it will go into more stability for yourself and for all the people that work for you. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this combination. Uh, we cannot see that, we need to see that the problems, if we have certain problems that we don't solve them, that they always return. So we need to work it out here until the bottom, until the foundation, that we have a very strong foundation here. It's possible that this work or this job or this hobby that you are doing, or that the hobby comes out uh, your hobby is grown into your work. This is what we are seeing here. That's why we have the moon here also. It's something that we really like. So it's possible it's grown out of a hobby here. But this is what we are seeing here. And it's possible that this starts from your home. If this is, this is possible, also this is a starting business. So if this is starts, all I said here, the foundations are very important here on the long run here. Um, probably you have a lot of knowledge. You are already an expert in your field because it comes out of your hobby. You have a lot of knowledge about it. This is what we are seeing here. And with the, with the heart here, we see a person that really likes what he's doing. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination. Also, if you make some uh, legal documents here, sometimes it's possible that there are some legal documents involved here. If there are some legalities, See that uh, you have wise counsel, uh, that people advise you in a good way because this is something that you build on the long run. If you are not clear about certain legalities or, or certain actions that you do, uh, just inquire uh, yourself so you don't have issues afterwards here because this uh, it's, it's all need to be solid and very fixed here. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Then we have the clouds the clouds and the anchor here. Uh, here there is a, a, a resolve here. We see here, you see, we see then again that you refocus, you concentrate very hard here on the purpose where you want to go. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. You don't allow any disruptions. You will be very strict for getting where you are. There's a very strong focus. You like what you do, you feel what you do, and you will not allow any interference here. Uh, you will uh, see that the customers um, are also satisfied, uh, even though it's not easy sometimes uh, for satisfying the customers because we have the cross here and the cross is a burden but it's something that we are destined to do we like what we do but it comes also with certain burdens and responsibilities the cross is responsibilities so this is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination it, it points also that we reach our, our goals here, uh, that we are very uh, focused on our goals here. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. There will be certain routines. Probably there's a routine also in the job. Maybe some routines are a little bit dull. They always come back, but there's a, also a, a satisfaction here in the job that we are uh, seeing here. But then we have the Lily, the house and um, <clears throat> uh, the person card here. Uh, here we see that, um, this is our uh, lifestyle. Probably we take care of the things that we eat. It's important for us here that we uh, take care also of our body here. It's important here. Uh, again, here we see the hobbies coming back here, where a work that turns into a hobby, a hobby that turns into a work. And you're already very uh, advanced in it here uh, with this combination. You know exactly what you're doing here. Uh, this is what we are uh, seeing here. People are close to you here also. This is what we are seeing here. Uh, sometimes this points also that we do business in an older house, not necessarily a neglected house, but the building that we are in could be antique, it could be old. This is what we are seeing here. It doesn't mean that the conveniences are old, uh, out of date, no, no, but it could be that the building itself, it has something antique, it's, out. it's an, uh, an old style house, a Victorian house or whatever here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination. Uh, then we have uh, here, th this is then the person. Here we see that um, this could point to somebody uh, that visits you here, a person that visits you. This is an intimate friend maybe that is uh, coming to us here. Um, this is a person that we are familiar with. It could be also ourselves. This could sometimes point to the lady or the man of the house, the, the one who's in charge for the business. This could represent you and that you applied rules, regulations on the wrong run. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. Also, uh, this points that we are uh, quite strict for keeping our business and our family um, uh, separated. This is what we are seeing here also. Uh, then we have uh, the lily and the man. Uh, here we see um, it's possible also, we see again here, this is a, a person with a lot of experience. In another way, this could 
be an older person or a person with a lot of experience. It sometimes also this points to a person 40, 50, 60 plus or older that has a lot of experience. This is what we are seeing here. Uh, and also the help that we are having, the people that help us are quite experienced. If we have employees also, they are very experienced. This is what we are seeing here. It's like we are seeing that we are surrounding ourselves with the correct, the right stuff that has the experience. This is what we are seeing here. For some people also, uh, if you have a starting business, this could point to a grandparent that helps you in the business. This could what we see here also. Uh, and maybe there's similar interests with the grandparent. Uh, and yourself here for the business and somehow these people are connected to you uh, also to the business or they help you here uh, anyway this points also to a person than you yourself uh, who has a lot of artisticity here um, uh, for instance this could be a person that paints in the spare time that do music in the uh, spare time or some your business is related to that music dance poet painting anything uh, especially with the moon because the moon is a very creative card uh, everything that we have learned here we can expand and we see what we are doing but we have the responsibilities of course also toward uh, towards it also our career slowly moves up and it's a pleasure a pleasure environment here that we are uh, seeing here with this combination but then we have the moon and the heart here the moon and the heart also it means that we are um, emotionally connected to what we are doing here we we get even though it's not easy sometimes with the cross um, there is fulfillment. There's a deep fulfillment and a deep emotion here in what we are uh, doing here. Sometimes also on the, this is a little bit beside the point here now, but this points to a lover who is very deep emotionally intertwined, connected to us. But in most ways, it means that we really have a heart for the work that we are doing here, but also it uh, relates to passion, passionate romance, soul for lovers here. This is what we are seeing here. Our partner could be very close uh, to us also. This is what we are seeing here and spend some romantic nights with the lovers or with the partners. Anyway, uh, Libra, this is all for the air group. I hope you get a little bit wiser out of this uh, financial business work card reading. If you did, please subscribe to my channel. If this card reading don't fit you, at all please check out the three that are immediately connected here i'm sure one of the four will fit you anyway i want to thank you for your time and of course you can check out also all the other card readings about other topics on my channel thank you for your time and bye bye for now hello libra and welcome to the stone or the earth group for your financial business money card reading for january as is your first card here uh, we see the tower the tower is the card of structure rules regulations here um, here um, also sometimes it points that we have, need to have faith trust in a higher power this is what we are uh, seeing here uh, also things will not go very fast here with this combination because we have the coffin here also and the coffin it tells us that things will take time but there will come a solution for it because we have the key the last line is very positive but if you have some business intention for changes here it will require some time because the coffin uh, wants to bring us first in the right uh, psychological mindset before we take uh, the necessary steps here. Uh, this is what we are seeing here with this uh, combination. Anyway, here uh, sometimes also we need to, especially with the mountain next to his ear, we need to be patient. Uh, we cannot force things. It will take time uh, before uh, we see certain results here. This is what we are seeing here. Also, we need to be consistent. We need to stand our ground and we slowly need to move forward if we can. But with the coffin, sometimes it's difficult to move forward. Sometimes it's a period of thinking before we move here. The coffin here in the central card here, it tells us um, possibly that we need to let go of certain situations in our life. Maybe we have built certain structures and the solution is for letting certain structures that we built in our life for letting them go. And if we let them go, um, it probably will come with a solution. It will become more easy for us here. Um, it's like certain things in our life are at the end, but we are not yet ready to let them go. But eventually we will let them go. So that's why I'm telling you here, this, there is a time here of waiting till you are ready to make uh, those moves here. This is what we are seeing here. But you will find the solution or you will apply the solution. This is what we are seeing here. And then we have the tower, um, the clovers and the 
uh, tree here. Uh, here we see that we uh, take some time out uh, for ourselves. We think here about uh, official matters here. Um, if we have certain wishes uh, and hopes, they will come true, but it will take time, as I said here. Um, here we see that uh, if we have uh, implement the right time and we are patient, we are slowly growing because the tree is the tree of growth. It sets roots in a slow way. These are two slow cards. Here, this is a slow card also. So we have a lot of slow cards here. And here, uh, if we uh, want to pro process or proceed, we need to do it in a calm, restful ways. But there will some things uh, uh, hindering us here. We see this here with this uh, combination. Sometimes also we will need some time off. We will find some peace and solitude here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination. Sometimes also with this combination, we see that certain opportunities are offered to us, but we feel that we are not in the right mindset and we say no. This is also what we are uh, seeing here with this combination. Then we have the clovers and the tree. Um, if we have desire for certain things, they will unfold at the right time. The, the cards here are good for unfolding, but it will take time. That's the, that's the, the key here. The, the key here is time, patience here. This is what we see with this reading here, with this uh, combination. Anyway, uh, if we uh, let it pass the time, we will find our vitality. We will find our optimism again. This is what we are seeing here. Um, we will be become more happy. Uh, possibly also you will spend some time in nature, walking in nature, uh, some time alone for relaxation here. It's possible also that you have some buddying up with some persons here. Uh, you, you go for some calmness, maybe with some uh, people around you here uh, with this uh, combination. It's possible that you are confronted with certain opportunities that you had before in your life and these come back to you in the future. So it's not the first time that you have these opportunities. So they are re-offered to you here. This is what we are seeing here. Also, this uh, points to duties, uh, that we are uh, having here uh, regarding uh, if we take certain opportunities, it will come with certain duties also. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Maybe there's a certain risk in involved here also, and we should think uh, quietly and relax about if there are certain um, risks involved here. This is what we are seeing here. Then we have the tower and um, the tree. We mirror the cards. Uh, here we see that we will uh, come on the right track to fulfill, fulfill our goals here. Uh, things will work out as uh, planned here uh, when we let it the right time here, uh, when we uh, implement the right rest. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. It's possible also with the coffin in the middle that you have a heavy, heavy period before and your body needs to relax. This is possible also with this combination. Sometimes we see this also um, that this is the reason why you need to uh, relax. Anyway, we want to get more rooted uh, rooted here. We want to become more uh, stable here. Uh, this is what we are uh, seeing with this uh, combination here. Um, anyway, um, then we have the tree and the bouquet. The tree and the bouquet here, uh, the, the bottom card here, um, this points that uh, probably we know uh, that we need to relax and also we need to see that we eat healthy. Here we see that um, it's important for us that we have uh, peace in our mind and that we eat healthy. And if we do so, it will also advance our body and our mind. This is what we are seeing here. Some people in with this combination, they go on specific diets, sometimes vegan diets to improve their health, especially if they're in a difficult period, if they feel that their body don't really cooperate anymore here. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. They, are, uh, they want to become more friendly for their body. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination. I want to add here also that sometimes here we see there is a, if you have nobody in your life, uh, somebody from the past here, a lover could reconnect here with you and this could also, this person also could uh, play a, a role in your life here. Uh, anyway, also this points uh, to a person. Um, uh, here also we are complimented. If we adjust our lifestyle, people will compliment us us with the changes that we applied. They see that we change our body, that we eat healthy, and we, we look also more healthy. We are more natural here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, 
with this uh, combination. Uh, then we have the bouquet and the tree here. Uh, here we see that we need to use our smartness, our originality. This is also creativity. If we use our creativity later on, if we are on the move, here we see that we are on the right track. This is exactly what we need to do here. Um, we should uh, input here uh, the ideas that we have, and we should put them to, to work. Things that we have learned before here could open the doors to our, towards our creativity. This is what we are seeing here. This is also, after this period of standstill, this is a fortunate combination here. It's fortunate for ideas, but also fortunate on the, on the financial side, because sometimes the book represents money, accountancy. So we have an upgrade here uh, regarding uh, to that here. There is uh, the circumstances getting better here. Uh, this is what we are seeing here, but also our attitude here. Um, it points that we are courteous uh, towards other people. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Uh, there's, a, there's a change here in body and in mind. This is what we are seeing here. We look better, we dress better. Um, also, we, uh, we receive compliments regarding to that. Then we have the tree and the key here. We, this is an uh, important an important achievement in our life that we are having here. Um, if we choose this path and we eat healthy, we are healthy, and we wait the right time here, we see that we are doing the right thing here. We, we get a different look on, 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 the, on life here, and the health will stay and food will stay important for us here. Um, also, we, 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 we realize here with this combination that we need our body to do to interact here. This is uh, what we are seeing here. Our body is key here to us. Uh, if we had some issues before, our body is key here. Uh, we need to take care of our body because it's our vehicle, so we have no choice, so we really need to respect our body here. Uh, then we have the clovers and the coffin here. I want to go there also. There will be, as I said, some delays here, and these delays will be annoying, it's not pleasant to have delays if we have certain plans, but you will see if you respect the delays after you waited, these delays will be beneficial to you. The coffin, it points to a standstill and it's like we cannot move, but the coffin is always moving, but it's moving inside. So we cannot see, we think the coffin represents like a standstill, but if we are still alive, there is not actually a standstill. There is a psychological transformation going on inside of us. And if we let this transformation take place, if we accept these difficulties and these delays, and we respect the, org the organization, the structures, the delays, here we will see afterwards we move faster. So it's, it's actually something, a delay that proves to be beneficial afters. But at the moment itself, it will be annoying when you experience here. Uh, but here we will see that the, we see here that the situation here is um, a relief afterwards. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination here. Uh, also, we need to pay attention here. If there are financial uh, activities going on here, that we have sufficient funds here with the coffin here, uh, if we do certain actions here, this is what we are seeing here. Then uh, we have the sun, uh, the book, and the key. The sun and the book here, um, Actually, this is if you educate yourself additionally, or if you would be a student here, this is very good for academic success, for studies that you do here. This is what we are seeing here. If you need to pass certain exams, whatever they are, uh, for, for your job, for your business, uh, whatever it is that you're doing, this is a very good success here that we are having for exams, whatever it takes here. Uh, if you school, if you come out of school, if you are in school here, this is very beneficial here. You literally have the key uh, for success here for your exams, whatever you need to uh, pass here. If you are expertising yourself in certain areas of your life, this is also very be beneficial here to that. There are positive things happening here with this combination. Sometimes also this points to teachers, educators, people who learn others um, afterwards here, especially with the tower. The tower can represent not only a business, but it can also uh, point to university. So this could be a person who has an, an, a post as an educator, but also has a business. So he uh, practices what he preaches. This is what we are seeing here with this uh, combination.
Also, this person is quite charismatic uh, as, a, as an educator, but also as a, as a business person. Also, this is what we are uh, seeing here with this combination. Also, you will be happy that you passed these exams. Uh, there is some happiness here. Then we have the book and the uh, key here. Uh, we are discovering certain truths in our life, uh, see things that are were not clear for us. Uh, or that were not available here are now accessible for us because the sun brings the light on things that were hidden. So this is what we are seeing here. We uh, achieve uh, a higher level of knowledge of knowing this is what we are seeing here. It's an important step here that you are taking here. It's literally that we get access passwords to the next level that we are uh, taking here uh, with this uh, combination. Anyway, uh, this is an important education uh, for yourself that you are doing here. Sometimes also it means that we are writing something, that we make some publishments about uh, knowledge that we have, about expertise that we have. We, we don't only write about it, but we write about it because we have experience in it. We are an expert in it. This is what we are seeing here. Um, this could also be about accountancy. This is what we are experienced in money. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. Sometimes this points to people who are very uh, expert in money. This is what we are seeing in accountancy here, tax lawyers, accountants here. This is what we are seeing here with this uh, combination. This is a person who is uh, quite intelligent in a structural way here. This person knows what he's preaching here with this uh, combination. Anyway, um, uh, it's possible also for the business, if this is not you, that you go and see for an expert for your business. If you want to do some business, you go towards somebody who is an expert in, in his field. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this combination. Sometimes this points also to a PhD that we get in abroad here. This is what we are seeing here or a doctorate in abroad here. This is what we are seeing here. If you educate in abroad, this points to the education, the PhD that you get in abroad here. Uh, if you have no formal education, this points to a person who has a lot of knowledge in the field that he's working and he expertised himself in its own way and he knows what he's talking about here. This is what we are uh, seeing here um, with this uh, combination. Um, you can see if I can add here. Um, also, some things that are in your mind are unlocked here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination here. Anyway, this is very positive. The, the key is yes study, education, accountancy. This is all yes here. There's happy security here. What we are seeing here, we are smart. We are, this is a very, this is a very bright combination for business here that we are seeing here for completion, for success here. There's a really significant improvement here if you let it the time. This is the, the last line here is actually opposite with the previous two. This is the period of waiting here that, that we are, confronted with, it stops and we go into the next level. That's why the coffin is important. The coffin is important because we need to come in the right uh, mindset. This is what, what I'm um, what, where I'm going uh, before here. This is what we are seeing here. And here you really, uh, if you wait the right time, you will really feel like a duck in the water here. Uh, you will think proactive things that are coming here. You will uh, see them coming. You will know them coming. You will have deeper insights because you have the knowledge and you have the key here. So Libra for the Stone Group, this is all for uh, this month, I hope you get a little bit wiser out of this work business um, card reading. Um, if you did, please subscribe to my channel. If this card reading don't fit you at all, please check the other three that are immediately connected here. I'm sure one of the four will fit you. Anyway, I want to thank you for your time. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. And you can also check out all the other card readings because there are several that we cover on the channel. Anyway, thank you for your time and bye bye for now. Hello Libra and welcome to the matches or the fire group for your uh, work business money card reading for the month of January. As the first card here on your person here, we see uh, the birds. The birds uh, can point to some stress uh, that we have in our life here. Um, here we see also that we need to be uh, 
proactive. We need to uh, look in the future what is coming and we need to be active towards things that are coming here. We need to take initiative here also. Uh, we cannot uh, sit down here. We need to be actively uh, acting for the future here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination. Also, there's probably with the, um, with the, uh, flowers here in the middle there's a lot of social activities we have a lot of social contacts here because this is the card actually that rules venus that's rules libra here we see there's a lot of communication here with friends with people that are close to us this can sometimes also point to a lover that we communicate with here uh, this is what we are seeing here anyway um it's possible also with this uh, combination that we uh, strongly need to fo focus on our social contacts because the clouds are there. So there's a strong focus on that here on the social contacts and maybe these are related to business. Maybe the social contacts are also related to our business here. This is what we are uh, seeing here. Um, anyway, then the middle card here is um, the flowers here. And here we see this is a uh, very positive here, the, the communication, the networks that we set up they are also financial uh, beneficial on the long run and uh, because these could really a uh, financial uh, benefit us if we make these contacts here but as i said we need to focus on it here uh, with this uh, combination also we are forgiving uh, here with um, with this card in the middle mostly we are forgiving we are kind hearted we understand a lot of situation because this card is ruled by venus and venus is uh, venus is the master of libra uh, then we uh, see um, the fish um, and the bouquet here. Um, the fish and the bouquet, uh, it points uh, to um, there's a recovery here uh, of money here that we are uh, seeing here uh, that is possible if we lost some monies uh, before, it's possible that this money is uh, recovered here. Um, if there are, uh, if we do some investments, it points also that uh, investments that we are doing uh, could have a very positive outcome uh, here. The, this is the card of abundance and this is the card of, um, of accountancy. So here we see that um, there's very positive things happening here if we do business investments here. Uh, these uh, investments that we make or about to make will uh, prove out to be very beneficial and we will really get our feet on the ground because the anchor likes to be anchored. Also contracts that we are made, these are two cards that belong to Venus. So um, uh, here, and these two cards are ruled by Libra here. And we see here that we become very stable. We are very serious about contracts also. We need to focus on the contracts here. We see here on this laying here, we can have a good outcome if we focus here. This is what we are seeing here. Also with this combination, we see that we are very creative. And also a lot of people are attracted to our business. Uh, not only attracted to the, to the business, but uh, for instance, this is not a relationship reading, but also people are attracted and also the opposite sex could be attracted to us here, but it's also very good for attracting business here, this uh, reading. There's a lot of attraction here, pleasant business, uh, this that we are seeing here. Also we ourselves, we are generous here. We, if we have sufficient money, we are also generous towards others here. Uh, this is what we are seeing here. Also, we will receive a lot of uh, flattery in the way that we look here. This is what we are seeing here. Then we have um, the bouquet. Uh, and the anchor here, the bouquet and the anchor here, it points uh, to uh, that success is uh, coming towards us. Uh, efforts that we did before um, and that we saw coming here now pay off. We get a really uh, self-confidence here. Uh, there's also a sense of pride here uh, towards uh, uh us here that is coming here, uh, we've become more stable, we feel more stable. It's possible before we are a little bit tight now, but since this, this whole situation is turning into a positive thing, it's like we loosen more up and, and actually we celebrate here. Maybe before we, we were in a difficult situation or a, more, uh, a less fortunate situation, but this is actually a very a positive thing here that we are seeing here. There's much uh, to celebrate here and we loosen up here uh, with, uh, with this combination. Also, it tells us in a way we need to be flexible, flexible uh, regarding contacts that we are making. We cannot be too stuck. We need to keep an open mind here because sometimes the anchor it tends to be uh, 
putting us uh, putting us uh, down and we could uh, start thinking in a in a in a, in a certain pattern, but we need to stay flexible here with this combination. We need to li literally balance our mind here. This is um, this is the ring, and the ring build bridges. It's ruled by Venus. Venus likes to have bridges. Libra likes to bring uh, build bridges on the long run, and this is what we are seeing here. And we need to keep an open mind here, flexible. We see, need to see that we respect the contracts that we are seeing here, because here we see also the contracts. There are important contracts, business contracts, work contracts here that are coming to us, and we need to respect those. We need to be very aware what we agree on here. And uh, it's very important that we do so this on the long run. But there's a lot of uh, social, uh, big social circle here that we are seeing here. There's a lot of professional courtesy, the social contacts and the professional circuit, it's like it's intertwined here. This is what we are seeing here with this combination. Also, um, if, if, this, if we are an employee, this is that we are partying with, um, with our people. And it's possible also if you're an entrepreneur that you, uh, that you have a party with your friends here. This is what we are seeing here. This is uh, a, a luck that lasts for a long time here that we are uh, seeing here. And we are really appreciate uh, the stability. It's possible also that some people help us and we really appreciate the help that we are that we are getting from these people for um, for achieving certain goals here with this um, combination. Anyway, we see here also there's a very strong focus on aesthetics, on beauty, on harmony, on creativity. Whatever your profession is here, there's a lot of creativity, things that we create. It doesn't matter if you're in money, art, whatever you are in, whatever your profession is, there's a lot of creativity going on here. You can be very creative in your field and you can really put your feet on the ground because the, the anchor wants to put his feet on the ground and respect the contracts that it that it has here. Also, the the, the friend of circles, this friend circle that we have here is uh, very uh, stable here. This is what we are uh, staying here, seeing here with this combination. Then we have the fish, um, the fish and the anchor. We mirror the cards here. This points to very financial stability, uh, stable, stable uh, situation here. We are financially becoming more independent. Um, also, we need to see that we built foundation for later on. We need to keep building here. This is very important here. And we need to pursue our goals here. Um, if you continue focusing and, and respecting your contracts, this is something that is very good on the long run. This is what we are seeing here. Also, you will become more materialistic uh, here. You will like to have comfort around you. This is what we are seeing here also with this combination. We like to have comfortable things around us if we come in a better financial situation here because there's a lot of abundance here that we are uh, seeing here. Our business, we want our business to become stable long term here. This is what there's a lot of cash flow here uh, going on. This is what we are uh, seeing here. We here with this combination, if we play it smart, we could really uh, get a foothold because the anchor is a foothold on the long run in the business that we are doing here. There are important documents here that are coming to us on the long run. Uh, with this combination. Sometimes also this points to that we can earn money off the books here, not all official here. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, combination. It sometimes it can points to a business uh, or money businesses, but not necessarily because we have the we have the we have the flowers here and it, it could be a creative business here, but there's a lot of money cards here. This is what we are seeing here. Anyway, then we have the birds and the fish. The birds and the fish here, it points to a lot of communication about money, a lot of financial transactions, a lot of uh, things going on here. We are, we are transacting with money, with accountancy, things are going on in accountancy, sales returns increasing here. The, the birds are always very busy. They are always busy with making money and accountancy. Here. This is what we are uh, seeing here, but it's very positive here that we are, uh, what we are seeing here. Um, and also we make, uh, we examine we need to constantly examine our financial uh, world here. We need to keep track of our world, especially with the clouds. So we don't. So we keep a very good overview. It's important to not lose focus here with the clouds. If you focus here, this is very good here. But you need to focus here on uh, on the things on your business here uh, with uh, with this combination. Anyway, it points also that your assets, whatever they are, they accum accumulate. 
you get a lot of things here coming to you financially, beauty like uh, things that make your life easy. This is what we are uh, seeing here with this uh, with this combination. Then we have the fish and the book. Um, here we see also um, it's possible that you educate yourself more. Uh, because the book is about education. So it's possible that uh, you, you not only gain money, but you gain also knowledge. You add additional knowledge. Um, this could be knowledge. There's communication here about knowledge. This is what we are seeing here. It's like we want to go deeper in what we are already doing. We want to get more information about the field, the creative field that we are active in. This is what we are uh, seeing with this uh, combination. Uh, also here, um, it's also, it tells us, the cards tell us here, we should, we should educate ourselves more if we want to improve more. This is what we are seeing here. We cannot stand as we are. We need to act proactive and see what is coming in the future. We need to act proactive also on education. Don't stay where you are because sometimes the anchor can be very grounded, but look forward for increasing your things more because this, these are good times uh, coming here. Sometimes also this points that um, uh, this points to that we get old knowledge back. Things that are already, um, that old knowledge that we apply in our business. This is what we are seeing here uh, with this uh, combination. Things that are already long known that we apply them in our business that have um, proven their value. This is what we are seeing here. It's possible also that um, you inquire with an expert what to do, or you educate yourself with people who are experts in certain fields here with this knowledge. There's a lot of knowledge. If you want here, you can uh, really have a lot of knowledge here coming to you about the field that you are active in. This is what we are seeing and it will bring you financially more if you want to for the finances here, for the money. There's a lot here. Uh, there's not a problem here going that way. Then we have the birds and the book. The birds and the book here, uh, it points uh, if we choose for the study, if we uh, choose for this, uh, then we see also that we need to perform certain tasks related to the study. Uh, this literally points to homework. Uh, these people tell us this is the way you need to educate and you need to prove that you actually done your homework. This is what we are seeing here. Also, you yourself afterwards, you will share this knowledge with others. This is what we are seeing here. But it, then is the, that is the next step then. Um, you, of course, you will not reveal everything that you know because the book likes to keep secrets. Uh, so we will of course, we will educate others, but we will not reveal everything. But this is a positive thing here that we are seeing here. But uh, reverse knowledge, secret knowledge of business is coming towards us. Uh, we it might also be that a part of the of the of the education that we do is very specific in a specific field, and some business secrets here are revealed to us. This is what we are seeing here. Uh, there's like a, a student teacher activity here going on here. You're already in business, but you're still studying and you're a teacher. Both are here are intertwined here. This is what we are seeing here. Then we have uh, the book and the letter. The book and the letter, it points to uh, that suddenly we receive certain news uh, that is coming to us. Um, we need to focus if certain news come to us, we cannot neglect it, especially with the clouds here. So if you receive certain messages about accountancy, about about import, the, the letter is a, is, a, is, is a document, it's not an email. This is an important document. It's like a bond, a degree, um, something that we can translate in money. So if you receive money or an inheritance or whatever, this is a document that comes to you that has value. If you receive this document, you need to pay attention to it because it's important that you get this uh, message. It could be quite shocking for you uh, that you receive this, but uh, uh, eventually it has a positive effect here. Uh, it could be a little bit unsettling this news. Maybe it's an inheritance or something, but I don't see, I don't have cards here from the past uh, regarding that, but it's a little bit unsettling, but it's financially positive. This is what we are seeing here. The, the message, it brings sorrow, but it also brings money. So this is what we are uh, seeing here. It worries you a little bit. It's possible that this letter has been under the way for a while and it, it comes to you in, in a roundabout way or it takes a long time to get to you. Here, this is what we are seeing here. Um, anyway, 
we could be a little bit confused about uh, this news. It could cloud our mind a little bit here. So we need to stay focused here, not to get intertwined here in misinterpretations. This is what we are uh, seeing here uh, with this uh, combination. And we need to keep our focus, of course, also on the study. So Libra, this is all for the FIRE group. I hope you get a little bit wiser out of this uh, uh, of this financial very prosperous reading if you did uh, please subscribe to my channel if this reading don't fit your dog please check the other three that are immediately connected to it i'm sure one of the four will fit you anyway i want to thank you for your time and i'm sure we see each other in my other videos there's a lot of information on my channel also about other topics about love about personal finances here you can find that all on my channel anyway thank you for your time and bye bye for now